G'day, welcome to Kaza's Corner, the place to be to impact and improve your life. And what do I have in store for you today? Well, I wonder if life goes full circle because last night I had dinner with my family, which was so wonderful. We haven't been able to do that because of COVID. So now that I can have them over, yay, it's wonderful. Now, of course, I've been left with a huge mess and it's not because they didn't help clean up. It's because the dishwasher <laughs> was full and it was fine and it got late. So we left it and I said, that, that's cool. And why is this important? Well, what is the message that I'm trying to get across today? I want you to work out what the mess is in your life and what age you need to be to change that. You see, I was looking at some of the things that my daughter brought back from me from our house that we have in Queenscliff. And I, going through them, it was quite remarkable what was inside. I had forgotten that I had done a Born Rich with Bob Proctor. How fortunate was I to be able to see him? And yet I had forgotten. Now it was in 1997 and I was actually pregnant with my son at the time. Quite remarkably, what I wrote in my seminar is exactly what it is I'm doing today. I wasn't ready to spread my message back then. Clearly, I had other things that had to happen for me rather than uh, doing what I wanted to do back then. You see, I'd become a victim. Back then, I'd become a victim to my disease, rheumatoid arthritis, which is a degenerative disease that affects your internal organs, your joints, your bones. It's really quite a nasty um, autoimmune disease. Now, how did I come across that disease? How did it happen to me? Why did it happen to me? When I stopped asking those questions and I realized I was causing the reason it happened to me because I was internally sucking down all the things that were not good in my life and believing from the outside that I was coping with them, but in actual fact, what I was doing was crushing it down and my inner being inside was screaming for help to acknowledge it and I was ignoring it. So it's taken me since 1997 till 2019 in January to realize that fact. And that's when I made a change in my life and I was 56. So my question to you is, what age do you have to be to clean up your mess and get your message out? And are you doing enough right now? Cheerio.